My name is Bill Robertson. I'm the owner and operator of Classical Glass of South Carolina in Columbia, South Carolina. I grew up loving stained glass. I grew up in a small country church where we had stained glass windows and I loved them from that day. To me it was as mysterious as anyone else how this stuff was made. My wife one year noticed that I was interested in stained glass so she gave me a class to take in stained glass for a Valentine's Day gift. Well I took the class and when I finished Hurricane Hugo ripped through South Carolina and tore up many church windows. We've been in business for 21 years nearly now. We've become one of the biggest designers of stained glass windows in the southeast. Uh, we've produced some 4,000 church windows. We've also done windows for all sorts of other applications, restaurants and fine homes and any sort of businesses too. Besides doing stained glass, we also do leaded clear glass panels. We do cabinet doors. Uh, and we, uh, we do beveled glass, etched glass, just about any application for stained glass that you can imagine. We do it the same old traditional way. We make our designs by hand. Every pattern that is drawn is drawn uh, generally by me with pen and ink by hand. There's very little uh, machinery that goes into this. It is a truly artistic experience. We've begun in the last few years to change a lot about what we do around here. So much of what we did before was aimed at the church business and the churches are not buying stained glass as much as they used to so we're looking more at fine homes and just the everyday sort of market and uh, that'll involve uh, doing some new and very unique and different kind of applications for stained glass. There are places where you can go and you can find the same designs printed out for anybody to do and get the same stained glass door that the next guy down the street will have and hundreds of people in your town will have one exactly like it. But this is the place where you can come to get something one of a kind which will never be reproduced again and you will have the only one of them that exists. If we're not careful, stained glass could become one of those dying arts. That's part of my goal is to try to preserve it. We want people to know how easy it is actually to make your own stained glass window. When students start out, I tell them that the, uh, the two things that they most need are a steady hand and patience. The people that you give these things to are always happy to get something that you've made for them yourself. Uh, so we have to reach out to more and more people to let them know how they can get involved in this. It may even be possible for us to do a, a design consultation via Skype with me personally talking to you about what you might like for stained glass and then get it to you at your home. Come to us, we can get it to you wherever you are in, in this country. Well, we're located on Main Street in Columbia, South Carolina, but you can also find us on the web and in Columbia Metropolitan uh, Magazine. Give us a call, we'll see what we can do to help you get what you want.